according to a report by Vanguard, Nigeria's Vice President Professor Yemi Oshibaju has declared on Monday his interest to run for the office of the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria in the 2023 general election. Professor Yemi Oshibaju's declaration is indeed bad news to Tinubu and Amichi supporter camps. But guess what? The presidential office is the highest political office in Nigeria and it is not anyone's birthright. People are not voted into that office based on sentiment but on competence. The larger interest of over 200 million Nigerians is better or greater than the person now or ambition of one man. Therefore, let the best man lead. But why is the declaration of Oshiba Jokosin Hulbalu to some people, most especially the Tinumbu and Amichi's camp? Today, Oshiba Jo has become a bugabu to some candidates who think they know it all. With the declaration of Oshibajo today, the political dynamics and tempo have changed and heightened. The real political music is playing now. That is why those who think they have conquered the political horizon are now suffering from a political quagame. The social media platforms have been over flooded with the songs of the betrayer and ingratitude against the lovely vice president. But it should be known that politics is a game that all Nigerians are entitled to play. It will be inappropriate for Shibaju to know that he is capable of salvaging Nigeria and then go on to support another politician that has no balls to rescue the country. Although politics in Nigeria, especially in the presidential primaries, has nothing to do with religious sensibilities to get support to emerge as a front runner, it is purely intriguing and you have to make attempts to win party member support by intrigues either by democratic means, financial inducements and propaganda. We however beg to differ those who are willing to cast the stone at the vice president may not know the calculations and strategy behind his declaration, which only time can unfold. Most importantly, the vice president is eminently qualified by law to offer himself for the position. So why not? <laughs> I said it before, when nobody had declared, at least from the beginning of this year, from Southwest, all oh, the Tinubu supporters, they were like, bek, 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 bek. especially Joey Bokwe. Ha, he said, oh, anywhere you go, eh, Bola Tinubu, anywhere you go. But like, everybody just talking about it. I said, forget all this initial gra gra. By the time, see, this thing was just starting. By the time you get to September, October, you know who is who. And now, it's not even up to that time now. We are beginning to see a lot of people coming out. And again, we learned that uh, Amosu and... Governor Fayemi will be declaring as well. So what now happens? We'll not be talking about everybody. He just quickly came out all this initial gra gra, which is not gonna help in the first place. They like oh they should betray themselves, so they like they should be grateful or have grateful to each other. It's none of Nigeria's business. That is not what we are concerned with. Oshibayo declaration may be causing Ulabalu to Tinubu's camp in the interim because they never expect Oshibayo to be so greedy. After eight years as vice president of Nigeria and still want to continue as president of the country for another eight years. That is the height of greediness. The president comes to South as a result of zoning. It's the height of a uh, uh, zoning. Okay. As a result of zoning, it is the height of insensitivity for Shibajo from Ogun State in the Southwest, which has produced the like of Obasanjo, Shonekon, and Abiola, not to talk of. Chief Obafemi Awolowo, all from Ogun State, and all Christians with the exception of Abiola, who was not a Christian, the Yoruba would not be ready to support another Ogun State. You see now, all of them, they will be telling one Nigeria now. They have started differentiating, you know, oh, yes, so uh, this one is from Ogun, this one is from, is from Kogi, this one is not from uh, Lagos. You see what we are saying now. Uh? When it comes to the real issues, they begin to say the truth. When people are saying we don't, we are not one, they say forget it. It is not possible. So what is the difference between a Lagos person, a a a, 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 a your man, uh, Oshun and Ogun? Now they have started the segregation. Where Ogun State indigen Oshibajo have nothing to take to negotiating table with the power block in the north. Than subjugate Yoruba interests in his desperation 
to become the president of Nigeria. Oshibajo na government chicken boy. Oga they come. Yes, sir. Give me the fire. Yes, sir. Apology to Abami. Abameda. Anipu la kukuti. Oshibajo candidacy will disorganize the relative peace in Yoruba land. The better Yoruba better Yoruba realize that nothing really good can come from Oshibaju candidacy. <laughs> it's quite unfortunate that such words are coming out of a person like you. Are you trying to instigate us against each other in the Yoruba land? You are religious by God. From your narrative, one can smell religious intolerance and insensitivity. insensitivity. Murikson. The only sellable candidate APC can present is Professor Yemi Oshibaju. Ashiwaju has many unanswered questions. Confirm. Now that's it. But these those who are just sentimental are just like not even thinking deeply. How long are you going to continue like this? Now, Baba Buari candidates be that nobody should kill him or her beg. They, they, I want to ask, I want to ask a very simple question. Did Oshibajo coming out, coming without the Jagaban concerts? My brother, we don't pass the level of this kind of question. Tinumbu BP is rising. Please, Baba, don't kill yourself because of Professor Oshibajo declaration. Where are Climbing pools. Um, when I read for what is uh, here, second paragraph, no make. Okay, I don't even understand it. It will fear God. Though. Ushibajo is my choice candidate. The man simply dropped his declaration and everybody started running up and down. Kitty, kitty, kata, kata. <laughs> Tilimbu is panic stricken and may begin to lose weight as a result of Ushibajo's declaration. His re head headache is loading. Thank God Oshibajo has shown that he is not afraid of Tinumbu. How can the declaration of a man that cannot even win his local government election cause Ulabalu in the camp of the Jagaban? When the panic made mood then, why the panic mood then? Why calling an emergency meeting of APC governors if not for the fear of Oshibajo? All of them, let them continue to deceive themselves. Some people just like this politics, they just like the way they like football, when they are not gaining anything, just to cool themselves. But this one is, is different from, um, it's really different from football, because <laughs> this one involves everyone's life. One's life depends on needs because of the policies and which we are all suffering from. Yemi Oshibajo is the right man now. Because they actually know that Oshibajo is more qualified than them. Moreover, that presidency post is for all capable Nigeria. It's not anybody's property, so they should mind Oshibajo Zulum 2023. Either Hulabalu or not, they are all APC families, so PDP should mind their business. <laughs> oh my God, I'm sure you don't even know what you are doing. They are already panicking. So guys, let's hear your opinion and I will take on this. Thank you.